Hello and welcome to IJN Heart News. Following cardiac surgery, the heart is susceptible to various complications during the early post-operative period. Cardiac arrest is a serious and potentially fatal complication which occurs in 5-8% to of cases, leading to high morbidity and mortality rates. Today, we are excited to bring you a story about ICERT. IGN Cardiac Surgery Emergency Response Technique, a newly developed emergency response technique that could save lives in cardiac surgery cases. ICERT is a standardized procedure that enables medical personnel to initiate life-saving measures in the ICU instead of waiting for the operation theater. Recognizing the urgent need for a comprehensive response to cardiac emergencies, the IJN team established the ICERT protocol designed to treat and manage life-threatening crisis in the ICU with an emphasis on early recognition and prevention. By establishing a standard protocol and training healthcare personnel to treat these crises in the ICU, the team aims to improve patient outcomes and increase the likelihood of survival. The development of this protocol is based on an advanced life support protocol, CALS, used in the UK but has been modified to meet the specific needs of the local team and cases. The development of these protocols was a collaborative effort involving cardiothoracic and vascular surgery, anesthesia and intensive care, nursing department, ICU nursing and many others. To date, ICERT protocols have been used in over 20 chest re-exploration cases in the ICU while waiting for the OT team and facilities to be ready, resulting in a 100% survival rate, demonstrating their effectiveness in treating cardiac emergencies. Currently, ICERT is designed mainly for three crises, including chest reopening for cardiac tamponade, internal cardiac massage, and an incision of the tube balloon pump. Okay, in IGN, we have a different types of uh, emergency response, right? Which is basically catered for cardiac arrest, which is code blue, yeah, which cons uh, constitutes the basic life support and advanced life support. But whereas the ICERT specifically is designed to address the issues related to emergencies after cardiac surgery, after heart surgery, right, in ICU itself. So that's the main difference between the two. To form this uh, ICERT it was not easy. So we need to get a small team, a core team to discuss what are the issues or problems we face in ICU, right? So then we, once we know what's the issue or problems, the next thing is how do we solve that problem? What are the limitations with current facilities or manpower and how do we overcome that? So we sat down looking at this and this took a good uh, one year to plan, to identify, to create an algorithm that is, uh, well, is workable in our environment. The IGN team plans to introduce ICERT as a part of the medical personal training requirement and collaborate with IGN College to formalize ICERT program training as a tool to expand the expertise to other medical organizations, such as KKM and other hospitals. This is a significant milestone in IGN's cardiac surgery emergency response capabilities. With its standardized protocol and algorithm, ICERT will be another program established by the Institute to demonstrate its commitment to improving patient outcomes and safety. The expansion of ICERT to other medical organizations across Malaysia will provide further benefits to patients. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Mariam Azmi and we'll see you next time.